hello and welcome to my channel in this tutorial we're gonna do this stitch it's a very easy stitch especially for you guys the the beginners the stitch itself is reversible front and back it's the same it's just one row repeat so I think this is nice to to do a I don't know baby blanket a pillow cover whatever you like to to do okay for this stitch we're gonna chain even number of chains so I chain here 12 we're gonna skip the first chain and in the second chain from the hook we're gonna go in there and we're gonna do a single crochet yarn over the hook and we're gonna go back into the same stitch where we did this in the same chain where we did this single crochet and we're gonna do a double crochet Skip the next chain and in the next chain we're going to do the same, one single crochet and in the same chain we're going to do a double crochet Skip the next chain and in the next chain single crochet and a double crochet in the same chain Skip the next chain and in the next single crochet and in the same chain a double crochet. So you're gonna do like this until you finish the well almost the row. So skip the next stitch, the next chain and in the next you're gonna do a single crochet and a double crochet in the same chain. Skip the next chain and in the last chain we're gonna do only one single crochet. Chain 1, turn your work. It's gonna look like this. So in the first stitch here we're gonna go in there and we're gonna do a single crochet. Yarn over the hook, go back again into the same stitch and do a double crochet. You're gonna skip the next stitch and in the next you're gonna do the same. One single crochet and go back again into the same stitch and do a double crochet. And this is the stitch, it's just one row repeat. So you skip the next stitch and in the next you're gonna put in that stitch one single crochet and then a double crochet. Skip the next stitch and in the next you're gonna do a single crochet and in the same stitch a double crochet. If it's easy for you to remember, what you're skipping, the next stitch that you skim, skip, is the double crochet from the previous row. And you're gonna do all this into the single crochet from the previous row. So you're gonna skip the next stitch and in the next you're gonna do the same. One single crochet and in the same stitch a double crochet. So you are left with two stitches, one, two, gonna skip the, ne the next stitch and in the last stitch you're gonna do only one single crochet. Chain one, turn your work, it's gonna look like this. So again the first stitch here you're gonna do a single crochet and a double crochet in that first stitch. Skip the next stitch and in the next you're gonna do the same. And go back again for the double crochet. Skip the next stitch and in the next a single crochet and a double crochet. Well now I'm working with a 7.0 millimeter crochet hook but I'm sure the the yarn that you're gonna use is gonna recommend the crochet hook number. So skip the next and in the next you put in that stitch a single crochet and a double crochet and that's about it. So you're gonna skip the next stitch and in the last stitch you're gonna do a single crochet. You're gonna chain one, you turn your work and you're gonna start again into the first stitch here. You're gonna put a single crochet and a double crochet, skip and put the two stitches there. And this is it. 
this is the stitch it's very easy and I think for you guys the beginners it will be great and if you feel like doing something easy and you don't need to, to concentrate too much you can do this I'm sure you can find some uh, some projects to do the sides are okay the side of the the work the stitch for a blanket I think it's nice doesn't need a border but if you like to put a border for this stitch I'm sure you can choose uh, whatever border you like to, to use. Okay, well, thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.